active streak in the major leagues. We're underway with a first pitch fastball to Terang. Do it again. Through three straight changeups. They all could have been. Changeup is definitely that pitch of the Astros this season. And Rolander with 3,366 strikeouts to Scherzer's 3,367. Takes that fastball for a strike, two and one. Pitch up, and it's three and two. He was aggressive with that fastball. Verlander and Scherzer have been trading. And hits this ball high in the eye at the wall. Puts it away for a wall. Missing down and away. It's one and two. Altuve goes after a pitch up, and Wilson has a strike. Wilson started his career with the Atlanta Braves. Pitched four seasons with 35 walks on the season. Jordan's back after a day off. She sees the Bryce Terang, and that'll do it for Henry Diaz. This ball in the air to center field, and Jake Bell, Mauricio Dudon, he has it. Yiner Diaz as well, trying to learn how to go out there and work with. Jake Myers didn't know where that ball was, so fortunately, Jake swings that he doesn't know about, he's kind of getting a feel for. And JV look times there while he was getting ready to go on the rubber, and so that fastball works. A little. Justin Verland over his last nine. Rounds this one to third to make the play. One better at that this year than last year. This one grounded to the right side as Bryce Wilson has retired his first five batter. Same played 11 games for the Brewers last year. Now he faces his former team in the offseason leading into 2023. And there towards the gap. In Three league fouls went away. Counts two and two. Ball popped up, left center field, the call and the catch, and that's out number one in the history. Nolan Ryan, Jamie Moyer, others, but this is the first time for less than half of his age, and that hitter ends up with a base. That they created this longevity, they didn't have to adjust like a Jamie Moyer. He just kept, you know, flipping break, creating that change up today. That ball line, oh, Pena almost made a great play. Whole hitter continues to do damage. That ball dropped in for a strike, 0 and 1. Terang with a couple of hits in last night's game. A little tapper towards second. Altuve can only make the out. At Challenge him with a fastball. And could skies it. Center field strand a couple. Yiner Diaz claps into his glove on his way. Yiner swings through the next pitch. It's 101. Yiner hits the ball on the right center field. Slight jump. It covers a lot of ground out there. There's another base hit by Jake. So good lately for Jake as he's a one out base runner. Fouls that one away, two and one. He knew he couldn't take three in a row. That one gets away. Wow. It's going to go to third. Jumped into the camera well. Line drive, base hit in the center field. Second, he's still being waved around. Hitter in that scenario all season long. This one to first. Bowers thought about going to second. Dupont did a nice job on that ground ball to Bowers. He ran with that throw because Doobie was right in that lane. Another one that gets by Contreras. This one he sees. That one's on the outside edge for a strike, one one Tucker on the move. The pitch is down. Here comes the throw. Not in time. And trust. Come. Ground ball towards the right side. Altuve will blow it. Verlander's covering. Nice play. Thomas fly to center his first time up. And Verlander drops in a strike. Ground ball towards Pena. Moves it up. And one short. I Sonia behind the plate. That one's up. It's two and one. Seven percent. Got him. Change up. Just oh, pop up beyond the infield. Coming in the right fielder, Sal Freelich makes the catch. Jeremy's going to try and use oh, that. Great idea. 30 feet. Not nobody on. Why not? On the ground to short. Just like last inning. <laughs> this one popped up. Dick Contreras giving it a look, and he'll keep the mask in his hand. And 
Here's Joey Ortiz taking a pitch off the plate. Did you see the story they recently? And it was it was legit. This ball into center field for a base hit. So the well, number was, but they came back and they're like, yeah, this thing was like 105 or something crazy with the pitch timer. And that's up and in ball four. That'll be his first walk allowed at <laughs> Angel Stadium through the years. Well, JV struggling with the zone here. Back to back batters. Churio showed. That one almost hit Perkins on a fur ball in. It's one and two. Testing. Pop up. Will it stay playing to be out of play? Now five rows going to go. Big 3 2 pitch. That one's going to be in play to left. Third is Ortiz. Dubon throw home. It'll be just wide. He's able to make his free look a tag. This one slowly hit towards second. Altuve is going to make the play to feet. 13th of the at bat is drilled deep to left. Won this battle. He kept fouling off two strike pitch. Brewers knock out. Yelich is looking to run, and he does. Here comes a throw by Yiner, and that is not quite in time. The three run home run against Hunter Brown was also preceded by a couple of walks. Heard in that inning. Ball to the left, playable. He puts it away for the final. Three, four. And Yiner ground. Thomas takes his time, throws a strike. That ball hit well in the left field, all the way. Jake Myers! It was a great swing, 102 miles an hour off the bat. That was a cut. Dube has struck out and grounded out. And this ball on the six-game hit streak with a base hit here. Have a couple of hits on the slider. This one grounded to the right side as he pulls the fastball. Oh, it's skied way up there. John Singh, it does it, and John has it in foul territory. This one towards third on two high. Two away. Couple of runs on three hits in two innings of work. There's a strike to free like the and one. Start was how he felt the next day. He said he felt really good, felt normal, and to hit. West Palm Beach. One two pitch grounded towards Singleton. That's going to stay thick. Four. Three. Has a slam against him and is lined out. Goes out and one to Tarang. A little shoulder for Jake Bowers. It was. Well, this time he doesn't have to make as tough a plus so on his um, scorecard result will not be his favorite tomorrow. That's going to be extra bases for Jeremy Pena who gets into second with a dump. Last night he threw John three fastballs before the base inning. Oh. Has thrown 13 of 16 strikes. And gives up a toe. He was on base for the third time tonight. Verlander started that at bat with 29 pitches in the inning and ended up throwing. But that just was excessive. That one towards the middle. Altuve will flip it to Pena. Nice play by the middle. That one into left field. Pretty wall. Makes a jumping attempt and it's off the wall. So Terang with his. Contreras did a lot of that against Justin Verlander, hitting foul balls in his plate appearance. Ended up seeing Astros that held him down until that home run. This ball that makes the play, and that'll shut down the Brewers in the third. There's a ball roped, but right at the short side. Yiner can't hit it much harder, but he's honest. 0 2. Takes one down, 1 and 2. Major League save with three innings of one run baseball behind Christian Javier. This ball skied in the air to center, hit pretty well. Does it play on it? That's out number two. And coming into tonight, he had been hitting 341 over his last. Sends this one to center. This one sends Jake further back. Parker Brzezinski, a 1 2 3 inning with a couple of fly balls on the season. That's 0 36. On pitches that end with the sweeper. That's one of the best in all of baseball for anyone. There is another out with the sweeper, this time on a strikeout. Yes. Tucker watches that one. That's a walk. Tucker second only to Aaron Judge coming in. 
Boy fouls one down the line and left. That's going to be out of play. Base hit. Center field. Seto's going to be a challenge for Hudson. As good as his numbers are. The Brewers dug out. In the right field. Player's going to tag. Kyle's going to head to third. The throw will not. Walled by the Brewers in town, especially in their third base coach's box is Joey Ortiz, former Brewer, John Singleton. He's like, I've blew plenty of plays winding, sending guys home. This ball is Payne makes the catch. The Parker Machines. Actually, that might have been Ozzie Timmons. I didn't get a good look. Parker Mersinski trying to get through two perfect innings, and he will. Pena makes a strong throw, which he usually does. Or our Jeremy Pena and the guy on deck, Yonder Diaz. As Singleton fouls one away. Now Trevor McGill, the right-hander. Hundo dotted up at the bottom of the zone. That is a call. In the center field, following quickly. Perkins a diving attempt. Catching that staff, including McGill. That one's going to bounce away. Jake can think about going to third. 